VAN 2.1 is an advanced and powerful visual generation model developed by Tongi Lab of Alibaba Group. It can generate videos based on text, images, and other control signals. These models are fully open source or open weights. You can download them on Hugging Face. So I just created, uh, you know, this particular video, right? If you see this particular video, I just created it on a collab notebook using VAN 2.1. So the prompt here was a yellow giant yellow cobra snake on a frozen lake, right? So that was the prompt which I had put over here, uh, a giant yellow cobra snake near a frozen lake, bright sunny day. And uh, I like the video which has been generated over here. There are a couple of other prompts which I tried which did not work. For example, I wanted a five headed cobra snake over here and you know, something else came up, right? And this is one more initial prompt, which I tried for a giant cobra, cobra, yellow cobra, slithering on grass. I don't know, cobra got converted to capybara or whatever is this particular creation over here. But this seems to be decent, okay? So you can run this on a A100 GPU. This is a smaller model. There are two models over here. They have released, you know, uh, there are uh, two models over here. One is your 14 billion parameter model. And the other one is 1.3 billion parameter model. This 1.3 billion, uh, bit, uh, what do you call billion parameter model itself requires close to 8 GB of RAM. I tried with the 14 billion parameter in this collab notebook on a 100. Uh, it runs out of memory, right? So you need more than 40 GB if you want to run the 14 billion parameter model. Okay. Uh, this is quite straightforward to run on a collab notebook. You just have to follow the instructions. You have to clone the van uh, repository. You need to install the requirements. Uh, then you need to download the model locally over here. Once the model is downloaded, you can actually um, generate videos like this. They have provided with the inference script where you have to specify the model, uh, the checkpoint directory. And then you have to say, if you don't want it to run too much on GPU, you can offload it to CPU as well. And then you can, uh, you know, put the prompt over here, right? Using this, you can actually download the videos, which I've shown over here. So if you look at the examples over here, uh, you know, they have created, uh, they have showed some wonderful ex examples over here with the 14 billion parameter model. So what they're saying is this is SOTA performance. It uh, supports consumer grade GPUs. The 1.3 billion parameter model requires only 8 GB of RAM and it can create 480p five second videos in about four minutes. Yeah, that's what I've observed over here also. It takes around three to four minutes to generate a video, okay. Uh, it can do various tasks like text to video, image to video, video editing, text to image and video to audio. Uh, it can do visual text generation also, basically um, generating text in video, right? Um, so what they are saying is that uh, these are some of the examples over here of uh, videos, right? It can do complex motions like hip hop, dancing, cycling, wall dance, boxing, motorcycle racing. It kind of captures the physics of the world over here, right? In these steps, if you look at it. It's able to do it. Uh, it can do physical simulation like cutting vegetables. Uh, you know, this is a surface uh, thing, archery, sputtering. Some examples they are putting over here. This, these are some cinematic quality clips generated by Van Eye, like underwater adventure, mysterious gaze. So a lot of examples over here. You can do controllable editing. Uh, something like post maintaining the posture in the video. Uh, it, you can ma uh, it maintains the structure in the video. It can do in painting, out painting. A lot of these things. Okay, so you can also go and check it out over here. What they're saying is that uh, this video, uh, like it'll be uh, basically the 14 billion parameter model uh, is achieves SOTA performance, but yeah, it requires more uh, RAM, right? Uh, for you to actually run it. It requires bigger graphics cards. Whereas the 1.3 billion, somehow for 1.3 billion, they say 8 GB RAM over here for the 14 billion parameter, they don't say it over here. Okay, but it is capable of generating complex visual scenes and motion, uh, motion patterns based on input text and images, including both 480p and 720p resolutions. A tech report is there, so we can look at the tech report, uh, which talks about what they have made use of. So they are proposing something called as a novel 3D causal variational autoencoders designed specifically for video generation. So that is what they are talking about over here. Um, so um, it makes this for say diffusion based generative models like DIT. That's what they're saying. You have an input uh, video or a frame and uh, this is how they are doing it over here. I'm not going into the details over here, but you can check out this paper to understand more about the details of say video diffusion um, transformer over here, right? Which they have made use of for generating this. So you can check out these details over here. Maybe I'll make a separate video on this, but this is just a first video on VAN 2.1. 
and how you can deploy it on a Google Collab notebook. I will share this notebook. You can check it out. Uh, the videos over here look very interesting and um, they have FAQs over here whether multimodal, uh, multiple languages are allowed over here. It says yes. Uh, however, the quality of output may depend on the language and complexity of the description. I think mostly it is in uh, English and Chinese which is supported, but I'm not sure of that. Um, so they also have pro versions and other tools over here. You can check out uh, these tools. You can play around with uh, downloading models and if you have enough GPU RAM, you can even try the 14 billion parameter model. So probably I think this might require at least two A hundreds or more to run the 14 billion parameter model. So this is a short video on WAN 2.1 from Alibaba. So this is another advanced and powerful video generation model. Hope this video is useful. See you in another video.